welcome, welcome. This is Marcus Bowles, President and CEO of Customized Minds. Thank you as always coming back here with me. Get some more of this great information that's going to inspire and empower your life. You know we got another great topic. We're gonna dive straight in so you can apply it, so you can share it, and of course you can keep that status as a super achiever. Today we are going to be talking about why are you so nervous? Now for real, why are you so nervous? You know what I'm talking about. Nervous about giving that presentation? Nervous about that sales call? Nervous about something that you need to deliver on? Why are you so nervous? Well, today I'm gonna to help you understand where it comes from and what you need to do about being nervous. Here we go. So, all of the nervousness that you have in your life about things that you have to present in particularly is stemming from one source, you. Yeah, the nervousness that you have before the event actually occurs is all stemming from you and the expectations that you are setting for yourself. See, the other people that are receiving the information, honestly, they can really care less. They can really care less about how perfect, how bad, how good, how average, how whatever it is that you are presenting is going to be. See, they're not coming in nervous like you. It's you setting that tone for whatever it is that you have to deliver. The people on the receiving end, they're just doing that, receiving, right? All of the nervousness that you have about whatever it is that you need to deliver is solely on you. How do I know? Well, isn't it once you really get into what you're doing, again, that can, it could be a performance, it can be a presentation, it could be simply sitting in an email, it could be anything. But typically when you get into it, what happens? All the nerves go away. It's like, boom, all right, I'm in it, here it is. And everything that you had preconceived, that you had thought about, that you thought how it was gonna, all that other stuff, before you got there, when you're in it, it all goes away. You're calm, you're cool, you're collected, you're running through it, you're, you're, you're executing on it, and you kill it. So what I'm really saying is stop putting so much pressure on yourself. Do what you do best. Simply deliver on it. Now, again, there's nothing wrong with having slight nerves and, and anything like that, but I'm letting you know where it's stemming from. So if you have anxiety, a lot of this will help you with that anxiety. Simply stop putting pressure on yourself. Stop trying to plan in your head, in your mind, every little thing of how it's going to go. And just simply prepare, practice, and deliver. Right? Simple. Prepare, practice, and deliver. That's all you need to focus on. The rest is going to work itself out. I promise you, the people on the receiving end, the person on the receiving end, they're open arms. They, they are literally open arms. Yes, they may have expectations. Yes, they may preconceive how they think this meeting, the presentation, the performance, X, Y, and C is going to go. But ultimately, when you deliver, that is what they remember. Not the, the expectation that they had or, or they remember what you delivered on. That's what you need to focus on. Practice, prepare, and then go kill it. That's all you got to do in your anxiety. I promise you, you can call me Dr. Bowles. It will be cured, right? All you got to do is practice, prepare, and deliver, and you won't be nervous. There's nothing to be nervous about. You are setting those expectations in your mind. So that leads me to saying, you have exactly what you say now. If you believe it now, it's yours to have right now and today. The power of life and death is in the tongue, more importantly in the mind, but first, you got to believe in the heart. Take care, believe in your heart, Calm all those nerves down. I'll see you back here on the next one.